My name is Katherine Allen and I recently retired from being the director of Sought Out, uh, an Exodus ministry in Virginia Beach, Virginia. Uh, I've known Jonathan since 1986 when he was just beginning the work of ARM and uh, networking through Exodus and sharing over the years um, has been a real pleasure and a joy for me. It's been uh, great to partner with Jonathan and his work now as um, AIDS Resource Ministry has grown into Embracing Life and its worldwide emphasis and um, the, just the, the addition of his writings and his work uh, in our ministry and other ministries that we've networked with that he's never even had contact with, but those ministries have benefited by especially the work on breaking free from the spirit of death. Some of the ways that sought out in the area of Southeast Virginia that I'm from have benefited from working with Jonathan and Embracing Life is that he's come and he's done an open conference for our community. Uh, we did one of the um, first and maybe only trainings for Embracing Life groups in Virginia Beach a number of years ago and out of that and we had several groups running in our area. We've also done the More Life training and had a very good response for people being interested in hearing the message about breaking free from the spirit of death, but also those who wanted to engage in doing um, the More Life group. I think of uh, the benefit and the support that I was able to give to Kathleen Dillard of uh, Prayer Central and how she's taken the books on breaking free from the spirit of death um, and asked for reorders from time to time as she ministers in India and Southeast Asia, where the stronghold of death is even more powerful than what we experience here in the United States. Uh, I've really enjoyed watching um, Jonathan uh, in his relationship with the Lord stretch and grow and, and bring forth this important message to the body of Christ that we would know that our gift from our Heavenly Father is the fullness of life, that we can have freedom from the things that have kept us trapped, and freedom for the abundant life, the full life of knowing what a gift and pleasure it is to be created in God's image and to be filled by His breath of life and experience our relationships with Him and others in the fullness of what comes from knowing our true identity. I encourage you, if you haven't utilized the material or if you felt, oh, it's too difficult for me to share, to take that risk and join others together and maybe just have a small book discussion group to share some of the common principles with people in your area of influence. And uh, out of that, you may then want to gather others into a more formalized group or a home fellowship group. But uh, I encourage you, if you haven't read the materials or don't have them to get them and if you haven't read them in a while rediscover review and re be reminded that we are not intended to live under the weight and the bondage of the spirit of death